Hey guys, my name is Crystal. I'm doing a reading for Earth Signs, Taurus, Capricorn, and Virgo. Okay, we're just going to pull um, a couple cards from each of my Oracle decks and then some from my tarot. Alright, so you have uncovering treasure. Beneath the surface lies great bounty. Okay, so something's about to be revealed to you. You're about to get what you were searching for or about to get something you weren't expecting. Okay, something's about to be good. Stepping into power, you are strong beyond measure, okay? So you are definitely getting a little bit stronger over this situation. Discovering truth, you stand in the light of truth, all right? Doing what you actually really want to do, doing things that you are called to do. Discovering truth, discovering why you're really here, okay? So like finding out your purpose in life. And then you have valiant courage, take action with passion, right? Take action with passion. Alright, so whatever you do, make sure that you do it with love. Make sure you, whatever you're doing, that, you know, it's something that you really want to do. Which I feel like that's what you're doing. I feel like you're finally um, realizing what you're supposed to be here for. You got strength again. Alright. So you got stepping into power and strength. I feel like you're definitely overcoming some struggles here. Okay. You have hope, all right? So I don't know if you um, are finally regaining your hope for the future or lost hope for the future. I'm not sure, but just know that as long as you keep hope, you know what I mean, and keep the faith, that's when things happen. When we give up, that's when we lose the chance to even get it. You know what I mean? You have the fledgling and you have fragment. First of all, I'm going to say about fragment. Fragment is kind of like a piece of something, right? So maybe you feel like a piece of you is broken or a piece of you, not broken, a piece of you is missing, right? You Maybe you're trying to, right now, um, maybe you're in the middle of trying to put the puzzle pieces together. It could be regarding love. It could be regarding family issues. It could be regarding yourself, okay? Finally realizing, like, you know, um, learning more about yourself. I feel like you've done a lot of introspection, right? I feel like there's a lot of new things going on for you and you're finally realizing stuff, right? Come, becoming more aware. The fledgling. This is about like the bird kind of like taking that first step or the mother kind of like pushing it out of the nest. I think that's what they do. But um, it's just saying, you know, you need to take that first leap. You know what I mean? And that's actually number one. So it's definitely um, talking about taking that first step. The tribe. Okay, maybe you might need some help. So if you need some help, it's always good to ask your friends, especially the people who are closer to you, closest to you, the people that you know that you can count on. Yeah, to be fair, so I feel like you're doing this because whatever situation you were going through before wasn't um, balanced out. It was a lot of chaos, a lot of conflict, right? Also, the zebra is kind of like shedding his um, giraffe markings into the, um, back into the zebra. So I feel like maybe somebody is finally realizing, becoming more aware of like um, other people, right? Uh, or um, seeing right through other people in situations, realizing what is going on isn't getting you what you want okay and then you have by the book like taking the steps that you need to right doing things in order in moderation you like taking the steps yeah ten of wands it's definitely something that's over you're definitely done with something it could be done with something that has to do with like wands are about passion so it could be an ending of a relationship it could be the end of a career like just doing something new right um the fledgling like, she finally is going to learn how to fly. So you're going to learn how to do something, right? And then you got the Page of Wands, which is new sparks, new, new inspirations, new ideas, right? And then the Justice card, which is just about, like, the to be to be fair. Things are about to start evening out for you, um, balancing out for you. I feel like you, this is going to help you to be able to um, make decisions a lot more easier, right? Because whatever this is ending, it's going to make you a lot happier. Whatever's ending, it's going to make you a lot happier. The eye of hearts, protection, good health. Just know that the angels are with you. You are being protected. The universe is watching you. Holy hell. Um, I'll just read all these because they came out. Okay, so you got Scorpio, Aquarius, Soulmate, and Ankh. Ankh means purpose of life you have so much to live for, and I think that's why you have the hope here. I do feel like you kind of gave up on things. I feel like you gave up hope. And it's like maybe you kind of realize now that you're like, you know what? I have to go ahead and keep on taking action and keep on going for what I want. Because if I give up, I lose hope. I'm never going to get what I want. You have soulmates. You are in union with your soulmate or you soon will be. Okay, so that's something good. 
And then you have Scorpio, mysterious, fierceness, intimidating, okay? I don't know if you're scared to do something right now, but the universe wants you to go ahead and take that first step, regardless of if you're scared or not, because you're never going to know the outcome unless you actually do it, right? And the first step towards success, the first step to, towards our new life is to actually take that step. So if we don't take that step, we just stay stuck. Then it says, Aquarius, it says you have the uniqueness that people look for but can't find. So if you're always wondering why, you know what I mean, you are the way that you are, and other people are, you know, you're not like this person or that person, just be happy with who you are, you know what I mean? Because most people um, look up to that, you know what I mean? They, they, they search for that, you know? Anyway, I feel like people might be jealous of you. Uh, King of Swords, you're finally seeing clear. Like I said, you're definitely seeing clear now for the future, please. The two of wands, you have the, you're manifesting something, right? What's you manifesting? What are they manifesting? Ace of Swords. Wow, you're definitely noticing your truth. Noticing your truth, stepping into your power, stepping into your truth, discovering your truth, whatever you may be, you know what I mean? This is also a part of a promotion. This can also mean that whatever you're doing is being upgraded, okay? So a big upgrade in your life right here. Um, lots of um, good cards here. You have the Two of Pentacles. You may be working more than one job. You may be doing more than one thing, right? A lot of stuff. You're like trying to find the balance within everything, and that's why you have the To Be Fair card and the Justice card. I feel like the universe does see you and does see that you're not giving up and that you keep on pushing with the Ten of Wands. It's like the universe just wants you to know it's almost done. It's almost over with. The Judgment card. The Judgment and the Justice card, To Be Fair. You may have some legal situations going on, and if you do, just know that if you do, with the Ace of Swords, the Judgment, the Justice, the To Be Fair, the King of Swords, if you're not dealing with legal stuff, then you're definitely dealing with, like, probably dealing with an air sign, alright? But I definitely, definitely feel like there is a decision that needs to be made, and that is what is asking you to bring, you know, to work up that courage and go ahead and take that first step. I feel like, you know... And here's hope on the bottom again. Do not lose hope. Do not lose hope. Keep on pushing because three cups is the last card that I pulled. Things are going to start working out for you. Your happiness is going to come. I just feel like the universe is testing you, right? Putting you through a lot of struggles, a lot of stuff in your way to see like, okay, you know, are they going to give up now? Are they going to give up now? They're testing your, your um, to see how bad you want this, right? How bad you want this new start. I feel like there's something way better you're going to under uncovering treasure. Things are going to start opening up for you, believe me, okay? You just also have to believe that, too. But if you don't believe it, and you don't, and you think it's always going to be bad, that's how it's going to be. But that's what I got for you guys. Um, thank you so much for watching. If you guys like my content, please like and subscribe. Bye-bye. Toodles.